Hello friends and welcome back to see for you in this video we are going to see laws and rearrangement its mechanism and we are going to solve some problems so basically the reaction is hydroxamic acid is treated with strong base like sodium hydroxide and this reaction is going to give you primary amine as a product by the formation of alkyl isocyanate okay so before going to the mechanism we must have to see how these hydroxamic acids are prepared to prepare hydroxamic acid acyl chlorides are treated with hydroxyl amine in presence of a base to be uh, they give you hydroxamic acid so now now we are going to see the mechanism in the mechanism we are using sodium hydroxide which is a base and in our compound i mean in the substrate hydroxamic acid this proton, the proton with the nitrogen, is very much acidic because of its electronegativity. And hence, it will abstract this proton. So now, one would be thinking that oxygen also has a hydro hydrogen and it's again electronegative. But this proton is more acidic than this one because the conjugate base which is going to be formed has the negative charge on nitrogen we are going to write here structure and this negative charge is stabilized by the resonance of carbonyl hence this conjugate base becomes stable and hence uh, this becomes the driving force for this step now in the next one with this proton this proton oxygen gets protonated and it leaves out as a minus of h2o we know OH is not a good living group but H2O is a good living group and it leaves out and now we are getting C. We saw in the courteous rearrangement key when your nitrogen has unpaired electrons and while the same condition in the same at the same time one of the living group leaves out there you are going to get a nitrogen as we saw in the last reaction carbon is also being formed in the same conditions okay so now here we are with the acyl nitrine and as in the last reactions here here only the rearrangement step takes place and now what you are getting is see uh, o double bond c double bond n double single bond r i'm not changing the sequence oxygen carbon nitrogen and the alkyl group is going to be shifted so this is what uh, alkyl isocyanate we have with and this alkyl isocyanate on hydrolysis is going to give you a primary amine by the formation of carbamic acid carbamic acid means this kind of acid okay so this we call as a carbamic acid and this carbamic acid is when subjected to a heat it decarboxylates that means co2 group carbon dioxide is leaving off and it's giving you rnh2 primary amine so this is what a very much simple and basic mechanism of this reaction now we are going to solve some problems now here is our first problem we have isopropyl hydrox uh, sorry isopropyl hydrooxamic acid and the conditions are sodium hydroxide h2o and heat i will write directly final product mechanism you can do it at your own so here what we are going to get is we are getting two aminopropyl or you can say isopropyl amine this is a primary amine not to be confused okay for this basics you can refer to the 11th or 12th standards uh, i think 12th standard chemistry book now the next problem is so here are the two problems second one and third one second problem is very much similar to the first one so you can do it i'll directly write its structure conditions are the same as the first one you are going to get here cyclohexylamine okay this is not aniline it's a cyclohexyl amine in the next one they are starting with acyl chloride now up to this 
we saw the mechanism and reaction starting with hydrooxamic acid in this condition you are starting with acyl chloride and they have given you hydroxyl amine with NaOH that means first you have to form the hydroxamic acid which will be your first step product and it would look like this one and now the cases are simple okay now with these two conditions you will get methanamide okay so this is what for today's video i hope you got all the points okay so in the next uh, video we will see smith rearrangement till then stay tuned and enjoy the chemistry thank you very much